Okay, hi everyone, this is my second YouTube video. This is basically a tutorial, basic tutorial on how to install FreeNAS 8. Uh, basically doing it in a virtualized environment, but this will be the same for wherever you're going to install it, hardware based, virtual, whatever. Um, just to sort of run through the basic setup. Um, and we'll be releasing some more videos on how to do some of the more sort of advanced configurations in FreeNAS. Okay, so basically I am in the BIOS of my virtual machine at the moment. Just going to disable a few of the things I don't need real quick. Um, get this to boot from the CD-ROM, which is fine. We want to exit saving changes. Um, just going to quickly mount uh, the image. Stored on my data store. Freeness. It's actually the wrong file. Freeness. There we go. Save file and exit. Make sure that's fine. Just gonna wait for it to do its thing. Okay, it's just basically loading the CD loader. Now it's going to default load the uh, the Freeness environment. Um, which is it's basically a live CD, so it's basically a live environment, so you can like try FreeNAS out, things like that. Um, we're going to go straight in with the installation. Uh, it's currently just loading everything, so give it a minute. Here we go. You are met with this screen. Um, we're going to go with option one to install FreeNAS. Um, yep, that's the one we want, FreeNAS installation. Um, this basically lets you proceed with the installation on your preferred media. Now, the ideal way of doing this is to install it on a USB key or an SD card, if you're using a server, um, something like that. Uh, again, if you're installing on a virtualized environment, it doesn't really matter, you just pick one of your data stores. Um, USB key or an SD card keeps one of your hard drive channels free for additional hard drives, so it's sort of good practice in a way to do it like that. It's, it's probably best if you want to add more hard drives later on. Um, so yeah, we'll proceed with the installation on that. Very, very simple right now. It's just going to run through the installation like that. Um, a bit boring right now, just going to wait for it to do its thing. You can see here it gives you a breakdown of the percentage just over here. Um, uh, duration roughly remaining, duration the installation is taken, that kind of thing. Um, it should now pretty much have installed. I think it's hanging on the last section to be honest with you. Oh yeah, we can see it's still, uh, it's still doing something here. Okay. There we go. A successful installation. Thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned for uh, more videos.